I'm not going to go into detail because I want to spoil the plot, but the story is rather cliché. As I was thinking of a lack of imagination, my first plot choice appeared. My palms were sweating. Not long afterwards, I met my first bad end. LOL. I have to dig up some more info regarding this whole thing. After finishing my dinner, I sat down in front of my PC monitor. Despite there being only a few number of players who got the game running, I chose one of them and looked into their profile further. Which one did I look at? Choices. Again, why do I? Oh, you know, like this button does work. I click it and nothing happens. Crazy. Player profile. I decided to check the other player's profile. So far, I only look at one player's Twitter page. If I do a more advanced search, then maybe I can find out more. I try a direct keyword search for a game. Here we go, a blog. This looks promising. A bad and play diary came up. The last update was a month ago, then abruptly stopped. So what happened? The information post is troubling. I decided to start reading it from the beginning. Ooh, okay. That would be a bit of a reading. My wish finally came true. I was able to download Baden. I'm so excited. Sally, I can't show any proof due to my lack of a digital camera. Therefore, any comments are welcome. I'm slowly playing for the game in my spare time. I'm not going to go into detail because I want to spoil the plot, but the story is rather cliché. As I was thinking of a lack of imagination, my first plot choice appeared. My palms were sweating. Not long afterwards, I met my first bad end. LOL. Of course, nothing happened to me as per the rumor that was circulated in the net. Naturally, there is a lot more of a game to explore. I'm still here, although I thought one particular time that I was actually going to die. Then I realized I was all a dream. If a main character makes the correct choice, then the story continues. That's to be expected, right? When bad luck really exactly how I got my second balance, Obviously, I'm not very good at this type of game. Okay? The update is and there. Work was only made it for four days. It may all be a practical joke. There's no evidence to back up his claim. He might possibly already be dead. The last incomprehensible string of eggs was likely to the panic or distraction. At the start of a blog, the information was pertaining to the player's initial impressions of the game. I'm going to be vague you. The storyline is cliché. From what the first post here describes, it conflicts with what the anonymous BBS post said. Most of the other play diaries are skinful aren't very helpful. Not surprisingly, they aren't being updated regularly either. Which one did I look at? Okay, well, let's go to the anonymous PBS. I accept the anonymous PBS board. I start typing into the new thread box. <coughs> My best friend who was playing this game died last night. I would like to investigate the mystery of his bad end. I'm not making any of this up. If anyone has any information, please respond. I merely got some replies. It's a troll. How did he die? Tell us. Should I pick or something? 
If you have some proof, I might believe you. Shit. Despite the quick reply, nothing was helpful at all. I was getting irritated. Just don't delve into the matter any further. It's not worth the risk, unless you've got a death wish. Yeah, I think you should just forget about the game and move on. No good can come of it, like dying. Your friend probably would want you to steer clear and not repeat his mistake. There was also a dead bit here that was unsettling. My heart started to race. But I bear it and take a deep breath. I need to find out exactly what happened to Yuji and the cause of his death. Although it's possible one of these people have encountered Yuji, they seem to not have witnessed any of these events together. Despite that, was it really a troll getting kicked out of this whole ordeal? Or did I really fall victim to this big game? Now I'm more excited than ever to start playing the game. It gives me goosebumps just thinking about it. Well, if that's some other person, then it's freaking... You're a stupid bitch. For sure, at the lack of useful responses, I closed the BBS. Okay. It seems that you can't run the game unless you are a specific person chosen to play it. Are the players able to download the game special in some way? Or was it purely a random? Which one did I look at? Well, I guess this is left. I decided to search for a game on a popular game information site. But then it's all the rage right now, so there must be more information out there. Oh, here we go. I accessed the popular gaming information bar and began reading. But then it's the new MOBA game which suddenly appeared on the network out of nowhere several months ago. Despite having a link to the download page, it's usually down. It seems to have a very sophisticated choice selection system. Supposedly, if a player picks the wrong choice, then they would die for real. We find it hard to believe that a video game can actually have the potential to kill someone. Somehow the administrator of the site hasn't a clue. The rumor surrounding the game is basically summarized. It's just like what Yuji had told me before he played the game. Hmm. One of the sentence caught my eye towards the end. It is said that there is a great reward awaiting the player that can clear the entire game without dying. A great reward, huh? I wonder what it is. Despite the danger of actually dying. People actually think it's worth the race. Is this the reason people are playing? Well, I'm not interested in price for bidding it. I'm only interested in getting to the bottom of what killed Yuji. I threw off the power to the PC and launched on my bed. Nothing I came across was very helpful. I'm starting to feel even more depressed. If I can't download the game, I can't play it. I want to play the game. If there is a god out there, please allow me to play the game. Yuji, you probably didn't really think that you would actually die in real life. It's only natural to think that way. No one just up and dies when you lose a life in a damn video game. But people didn't take it seriously and play the game like they would any other and, and pay the ultimate price. Even I don't know who's responsible for this. Just sitting here won't help me find out. My mind was made up. I decided that I'd be it bad end and find out the mystery behind Yuji's death. So since deciding on that, I can't wait to get started on the game as 
soon as possible. I tried on the game multiple times while on break between classes, but the download refused to start. Damn it! Why can't I download it? Q hey. Oh, hey, Kataman. What's up? Uh, what's with a long face? So right for me. Regardless, I'll do just apple anything to get this thing game up and running. If something is troubling you, I'm here to listen. I'm too desperate to look into Baden. It's all I can think about. Have you heard of a mobile game called Baden? I've heard of it. It's where if a player dies in game, then they die for real. Despite all the current information on the net, it seems people are elaborating on their own personal experiences within the game. Yuji had played the game before he died. Huh? The game was still installed on his phone. When I attempted to boot the game, the app just disappeared from the main screen. It seems that someone was trying to sabotage any traces of a game's activity. I can't believe such a game actually exists. So, Yuji died from playing the game. Not a damn disease. No way. Come on, Kyuhei. Kenama was clearly annoyed by my explanation. Our fellow classmates turned to look in our direction at the commotion. Don't buy into such a stupid rumor. He died of an underlying medical condition. If it's such a stupid rumor, then tell me why it's not true. Just face the facts. I saw the game disappear from the phone with my own eyes. Try explaining that. This is the God's honest rule. I'm not making this shit up. That's why I'm going to find out what happened to Yuji by any means possible. I know it's hard on you to lose your best friend of 10 years, but you have to move on. But don't misunderstand. You can't let yourself fall to despair over someone who has passed on. There's nothing more you can do. The expression in my eyes were one of disbelief and helplessness. I didn't know what to do or say to him. Thanks again for trying to cheer me up. I'll see you later. I spent the rest of the day at school avoiding everyone. I was in the mood to socialize. Is it really a hopeless situation? Is it just stupid of me? To want to find out the reason behind the death of my best friend? No. I refuse to believe that. But after talking to Kanama, it just attached my hopes of pursuing the truth. I want Claire silently in a reply on the anonymous PBS for surface in my mind. He basically said to stop trying. Unless I had a death wish. I eventually come down after remembering those words. Yes, I'm afraid of dying. But finding out about Yuji's death was worth the risk. Should I just ignore my gut feelings? Though I scream in frustration to know that I could potentially die, I couldn't help but think. Anything should happen to me. What would my parents do if I died?